everyone, it's Misty from The Joy of Enough. Welcome to day 29 of Vita. Um, it happens to be my birthday today, so I thought instead of doing a coloring video, I'm gonna make a birthday card. And the birthday card is not gonna be for me, because that would be kind of weird. <laughs> but my niece has a birthday next month. I mentioned her, I think, in yesterday's video. So I wanna go ahead and get her card ready to go. And I'm gonna be using the BYOP stamp set from Stampin' Up. This is available right now in the Occasions Mini Catalog. This is, BYOP stands for Buy Your Own Present. And we're sending her either a gift card or some cash for um, her birthday. So I thought this would be a perfect stamp set for that. And I'm gonna be using the Simple Stories DIY Boutique. Um, I love the colors in this um, paper stack. They just remind me of like a fun teenager and she's turning 16. So I thought these would be absolutely perfect. And some of them are coming out. <laughs> so I'm gonna use the BYOP Buy Your Own Present on the outside and then thought you'd like to spend your, spend your day spending um, and maybe happy birthday or all right, happy birthday. So. Let me show you what I got started. I am using basic black for my card base. So this card base measures four and a quarter wide by five and a half tall. So I cut a piece of cardstock down um, from eight and a half by 11 to four and a quarter by 11 and then scored it at five and a half. I have an outer layer that is Daffodil Delight. This measures four by five and a quarter. And then I have this piece of pattern paper that is an eighth of an inch smaller. So it's three and seven eighths by five and one eighth. I think that's right. <laughs> so I'm gonna attach this using some fast fuse. So again, you just pull it down and go to the side. <laughs> This great, this stuff is great, and it's actually on the weekly deals this week. So, check that out if you want to. Okay, so there's my focal panel, and it's crooked. Eh, it's just a little crooked. We'll be all right. Okay, so then I'm gonna bring in one of my tag toppers, and I'm actually gonna bring in the this angle tab. This is on the retired list, so if you haven't picked this up, you're gonna want to. I have two pieces cut. I have a piece of Whisper White cut to one and seven eighths, and a piece of pattern paper cut down to one and seven eighths. And we're gonna make two tags, so all you do, you can make them as long as you want to. You just slide this in, all the way, punch down, oh, voila, you have an angle tag. Let me try the other side. Let me turn this over so I can make sure that it's, that it's even. That looks about right. And then I'm gonna cut it, and there's our tag. I'm gonna do things, I'm gonna cut this down so I don't mind that part. Okay, so we got those two done. You can make a little confetti if you want to. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna bring in my stamp set. This is a photopolymer stamp set. So you know I love it. And I'm actually gonna use my my favorite things hyper ink because I'm actually gonna color so you're still getting some coloring today <laughs> but I'm not coloring a huge image I'm gonna color the inside of these letters so let me pick this up with my block I still have Easter grass everywhere oh, that block's not big enough it's not quite big enough I really need to clean my blocks. Oh, it's on my to-do list. <laughs> my whole craft room is on my to-do list. I feel like I need to just hose it down and start all over. My, I'm sure my husband is going crazy because he can't really stand mess. 
Like, I am the messy one out of the two of us. And that's and actually why I have a craft room because I, when we lived, like we had an apartment before we got this house and he was like, you need a craft room. <laughs> you need a place to contain your mess. And I was like, yeah, I probably do. I'm not gonna disagree with you, sister or brother, honey, sir, whatever. I say sister a lot with the people I work with, so. Call everyone sister. Sister? Well, if they're lady, I'll call everyone sister. Ha ha! So let's do the buy your own present. And I'm just lining this. I don't know if you can see that because I'm trying to do it so where I can see it. But I'm just using my gray paper to line this up so it's straight before I pick it up with my block. doesn't look half bad. It's not perfect, but you know what? <laughs> I really am. I really am. Okay, so I'm going to bring in my markers and I'm going to color. So I have Bermuda Bay, Melon Bombo, Pumpkin Pie, and Daffodil Delight. I'm going to color in these letters. You could also have used stays on, but I don't like to use stays on unless I really have to use stays on because I don't like the smell of it really. I'm using Whisper White cardstock if I didn't mention that. If I did not tell you, let's do yellow. Yellow. I actually wore yellow and pink today. It's actually about the color of this Bella Mumbo. I'm sure I look like a highlighter. <laughs> I don't mind. I don't mind looking like a highlighter. It's okay. I love bright colors. You guys may, <laughs> you may have noticed from the cards I make, but that's how I like to dress as well. Definitely not afraid of color. You won't see me in a whole lot of neutrals. Well, you will on the bottom. I mean, most of my pants are neutrals, but I did buy a pair of coral shorts for the summer. So we'll see how that goes. What other color is in this? Red. Could try green, I guess. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Let me bring in a real red. I never know where the... And then finally, let me try garden green. Garden green. For our little periods. Oh yeah, that's pretty. I like it a lot. Okay. So let me bring in my trimmer. I don't trust myself. <laughs> I don't trust myself. To cut straight with scissors. I really just don't cut, trust myself to cut straight with scissors. So there we go. Okay, so while before we put our front panel on, let's go ahead and stamp the inside. So how would you like, thought you would like to do, spend your day? 
fun that you would like to spend your day spending. Oh yeah. Sorry. <laughs> Someone asked me today, she's like, do you make up songs to everything? I'm like, yeah, I make up songs all the time. That's what I do. Some of them are funny. Some of them are inappropriate. <laughs> But I make myself laugh, and sometimes that's all that matters to me. Sometimes just making your own self laugh is all that matters. Okay, so I have an inside panel of Whisper White that measures four by five and a quarter. So close. I have that Neil Sadaka song, Happy Birthday Sweet Sixteen, stuck in my head. I think I sang it. <laughs> I think I started singing that the other day on camera, not on purpose, but because she is turning sixteen, so. It's stuck in my head. Do you guys know what song I'm talking about? <laughs> I can't start singing it because it's a copyrighted song and I don't want to get in trouble. But I'm singing it in my head if you want to sing along. <laughs> Look at this. Now I have this extra strip. Oh, I am dumb. <laughs> okay, I was gonna do a side folding card, but that's not gonna work. So, whatever, Misty. Geez Louise. But my sentiment's gonna be crooked on the front. I think it'll be alright. It's gonna be alright. It's a thought that gown. She's not gonna care about the card. All she's gonna care about is the money. Well, maybe not. So my idea was to have this on the front, but obviously it's too long. <sighs> because it was gonna be a side folding card. I guess it could still be a side folding card. I'm just going to use my scissors. <sighs> you already know what I'm going to say, so I'm not even going to say it. <laughs> not going to do it. I'm not even going to say what I was thinking. I have a special video for you guys tomorrow.
For day 30. For day 30, the last day of Vida. Vida! Vida! This is um, some black, basic black baker's twine. Do I want to thread them together or do I just want to tie a bow? On the front. That is the question of the day. So, um, <laughs> I think it was yesterday's video. It may have been a video from a couple of days ago. I realized that I had Cheeto fingers because I'd had Cheetos with my lunch. And I was like, I thought I got it all off when I washed my hands. Apparently I did not. So if you saw the video with my orange fingers, I apologize, but I had some Cheetos, okay? I had a sandwich and I had some Cheetos, some Cheetos. I don't eat Cheetos very often. I mean, I try not to eat bad stuff very often, but I'm not gonna sit here and lie and say I don't ever eat it because that would be a lie. And liars, lines not okay, okay? Lines bad, okay? We think. I kind of like it. I kind of like it. I don't know if you guys are going to like it. But I... Maybe like that instead? I don't like that. And then I can cut off the ends. Yes, yes, I like this. I need to get, <laughs> I've got paper everywhere. It's sticking to everything. Okay, I'm gonna trim off the tails. Like that. Okay, so I have to trim off this side. No, that's pretty good. That's all right. See if I can tie tie this in a bow. Well, that's gonna hang off the side, so I don't like that. are having a fantastic week we are having oh weird weather oh my gosh <laughs> sorry oh oh that just sent chills down my back oh oh sorry the sound or the oh, the sound of this twine oh going through the paper is like oh I don't like it <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh today this video is gonna be cry cry oh oh. <laughs> Can't that. oh I hate it oh why is it be so gross stop it I just want to get this twine out Oh, dude, I'm going to get 5,000 thumbs downs on this video. I already know. Oh, I can't. I just can't. I just can't. <laughs> can't eat that. Ooh. Oh. Does anybody else have an issue like that with sounds? Like, oof. I just, oh, I just can't. I can't. I just can't even... I've lost the ability to even. Okay, so let me tie some twine. Which one is gonna be easier?
this ribbon, but is that just too many stripes? Too many stripes? This, I think, is retiring, if it hasn't already. This is Bermuda by Striped Gross Grain. What if I said, every time I think I'm gonna get on here and I'm gonna make a quick little video and just be done with it, it always takes me half an hour. deliver this anyway so if she if she has a party we will probably go to Oklahoma's this looks so pretty when other pe people do it I'm probably gonna tear it if I pull it back through. This looks like needs to be reserved for like wrapping presents or something because it's so thick and so pretty. Apologize if I've sniffed like 30 times in this video. I'm still getting over my little illness from last week and I have some lingering Thank you. You know what? Let me grab a lighter. It made things worse, you're thinking? No. Hopefully not. Grab a lighter. <clears throat> if you already know this trick, all you have to do to stop a ribbon from fraying is to take a lighter and just hit the edges. And it seals them. Not for very long. And you're not trying to singe it. Like that, don't catch it on fire. <laughs> don't catch it on fire like I just did. But it seals the edges and it keeps them from fraying. That's what I do when I make the bows for my ornaments.
I like this. Oh, I like it. Uh, dimensionals or glue dots? Probably glue dots because I'm going to have to use like 30 of them. What do you guys think? I think it's cute. It's very strappy. Very strappy. You know what it needs? <laughs> it needs some shimmer. Where's my, where's my wink of Stella? Every girl needs some shimmer. Ooh, that's really shimmery. Holy cow. Uh, I need a scratch piece of paper. I should. This is a little too shimmery. Look at that. You can barely tell it's red. There's so much shimmer. I think I'm almost done with this pen, and that might be why. Perfect. Seriously, I like it when a plan comes together. So this is my birthday card, or the birthday card for my niece, Lauren. Hopefully she likes it. She better love it. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm in a mood today. I'm filming this on Tuesday, and my actual birthday is when you're watching it. And I guess I have some sassy britches on, so I don't know. I don't know. So like I said, I'm gonna be back tomorrow, which will be Vida de 30, the last day of April 2015, with a very special video. Hopefully you'll join me. Hopefully I will remember to schedule it and get it uploaded, because Tuesday's video, it totally, <laughs> I totally thought I did it, and I sure didn't. So it's processing right now. Okay guys, thanks so much for watching. I really hope you've enjoyed this series. Um, as always, links to what I can link to will be in the description box below. Don't forget about the retired list from Stamping Up. Things are going super duper fast. So if there's something on that that you think you wanna pick up, make sure you do it pretty quickly. Um, if you have any questions, make sure you leave them down below. Thank you for watching, liking, subscribing, all that good stuff. And I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye now.